Hey everyone, I'm here with Holly today and uh, you guys probably all remember Holly from some of our cooking videos and makeup videos. Um, today Holly is going to uh, be my model for a feather extension tutorial. I'm going to show you guys how you can put feather extensions in your hair yourself. I was going to originally show you guys, you know, how you can go to the craft store and pick out all your tools and everything that you need. But then I found a kit uh, online at uh, the store of Bantu where I get my wigs from and um, for everything for the uh, needle to do the beading with, the four feathers and the crimping beads, it was $35. So I'm going to show you how you can easily do it at home on a friend and uh, save yourself some money. I think it's a good back to school look and I think it's going to look good on Holly. So you're going to take your beading needle that comes in the kit and I've just got the top of it pinched together here and we're going to take our crimping bead and we're going to put it through the center of the bead and then just drag it down to the bottom like that. Now I'm going to select a section of hair on Holly and it doesn't have to be a lot of hair. Um, you guys can see about that much. Then we've got our strand of hair and we've got our beading needle. We're going to take the hair and just put it through the center of that. Just pull it through, just like that. Pull it right through the center. And then all we need to do is take our bead and pull up on it. And this comes out and the bead is around the hair. Now we're gonna take the feathers and what you want to do is you wanna put it, um, the end of it into the bead and on top of that piece of hair. So that piece of hair is gonna fall just like that underneath all the feathers, okay? And then all you need is a pair of uh, pliers and we're gonna give that a squeeze until you feel it clamp down. And then we'll cut that little end off so it doesn't poke into Holly's scalp. So now you can see that we've done that a little bit under um, Holly's other pieces of hair. So when everything comes back into place, that's concealed. And I'm gonna show you guys how to curl this one because I think it'll blend in really nicely with Holly's hair and just show you guys how it does actually take to the heat. I'm going to use my crimping iron because uh, it's got a nice uh, small barrel on it and just wrap it around. I think it'll be kind of consistent with uh, Holly's natural curls. So I'm going to start down at the bottom and just wrap it all around like that and then just clamp it. And I think you probably only have to hold it, I'd say, for no more than 20 seconds. And we'll let it go. So I do think that is an advantage of getting this kit. Uh, I'll put the link uh, to the store. You can buy them online because they are high quality and you can continuously curl them, straighten them, curl them. They'll straighten out once you uh, wash your hair so they can get wet. You can wash your hair. You don't have to worry about them. Um, again, they're going to last you four months and I just think they're so super cute. Really cool. You can put a few more in your hair. Uh, again, I think a really nice um, back to school look. Thank you, Holly. Really okay. suits you. It's super cute. 